ICP, what price might it be in 2024 and 2025? Before moving on, I just want to bring your attention to the fact that today is September 29th, 2024, and it is currently about 1 p.m. Pacific time, which is local time for me. And just to take a quick look at some of the market caps of the top 10 or top 20 cryptos, we have Bitcoin at about 1.3 trillion, Ethereum at 321 billion, BNB at around 87 and a half billion, Solana at a little shy of 75 billion, XRP at just under 37 billion, Dogecoin at closing in on 19 billion. We have Toncoin at nearly 15 billion, ADA, which is Cardano, at just slightly over 14 billion. And if we scroll down, the 20th position currently is Light coin at about five and a quarter billion and of course internet computer which is what we are here to talk about today is at just over four and a half billion dollar market cap all prices are being sourced from coinmarketcap.com and now on to what we're all here for today which is icp price speculation i think that what we're going to be talking about is relatively conservative and realistic if icp today had the same market cap as card which is about $14.1 billion, then the price of ICP would be about $30.55. With a market cap of Dogecoin, internet computer would be just under $40 at $39.78. For reference, Dogecoin currently has a market cap of about $18.7 billion. With a market cap equivalent of XRP's $36 billion market cap, ICP would be about $77.90. Two cents. With a market cap equivalent of Solana, which is $75 billion, ICP would be $158.95. ICP with a market cap equivalent to BNB, which is about $87.4 billion, the price of ICP would be about $185.54. With a market cap equivalent to ETH, which is about $321 billion, the price of ICP would be $680.00. 92 cents. ICP with a equivalent market cap to Bitcoin, which is $1.3 trillion, the price of ICP would be about $2,764.36. Now, if we put a price in that's not too off from today's price. So if we put in a token price of $20 for ICP, that would give us about a $9.4 billion market cap, according to this tool over at Coin Perspective. However, this is overestimating a little. This would this would actually be probably a couple hundred million less than the $9.4 billion market cap. However, I certainly think that a $9.4 billion market cap for ICP is easily attainable in 2024. I mean, we were already there once earlier this year. Personally, I don't think we're going to see a price higher than about $35 in 2024. I also think that these prices are relatively conservative, and I think that conservative prices are better because I rather underestimate rather than expect to be, you know, like a multimillionaire and then end up coming up with $600,000. With a price of $35, internet computer would have a market cap of over 16 billion. And I think that that is not only possible, I think that that is relatively likely before the end of 2024. With a price of $160, that would put us back up around 75 billion, which again, as a reminder, that is the market cap of Solana today day as we see here. You also want to keep in mind that one of the many things that can happen to affect price is whether or not ICP flips deflationary, either in 2024 or in 2025. Right now, we're definitely not burning anywhere near as much as we're minting. However, recently, we were getting much better numbers because Bob and Burn were both burning a lot of cycles, and that's kind of dropped off a bit. However, other projects can be launched other activity can happen, which can end up greatly increasing the burn. In addition to that, you know, an NNS proposal could come through that could even reduce the amount of ICP that is being minted, potentially. You never know for sure what's going to happen, but this is one of the things that will affect the price of ICP, the same as most other cryptos for that matter. So in 2024, I expect an ICP price to be somewhere probably in the $20 to $35 
$1,000 price range. As far as what it will close 2024 at, I'm going to say probably around $30. And I want to be clear, this is not based on technical analysis. I'm not looking at charting Elliott waves and Fibonacci and any other technical analysis. This is just a gut feeling. And to that point, I have been doing the same thing with Bitcoin this year, starting in February. And I haven't done that bad with just kind of pulling numbers out of my butt. In fact, I suggest that you look down in the video description if you doubt what I'm saying, because I link to multiple other videos where I am just throwing out prices and seeing what happens. Now, that doesn't mean that future performance is going to equate to past performance in terms of just how close my guesses have been. Of course not. But before you write me off as just yet another Looney Tune, well, I've already done this with Bitcoin and my price guesses, they haven't been so bad thus far. Fortunately, we just have two, three months to wait and see what happens with ICP as well as Bitcoin, and then we'll know for sure and there will no longer be any reason to debate it. However, in 2025, I think ICP should get up to bare minimum the 80 to $100 price range, and that that's actually, I kind of feel like a bear case. I think that we should easily get to $100. Now, from there, whether we end up being 103, 127, 142, you know, I'm not so sure. I kind of feel like we could be anywhere between something like $120 all the way up to maybe $250 between now and the end of 2025. However, I think the real bull case is going to be moving forward from there. As most of you know, if you are ICP bulls already, ICP is one of, if not the only blockchain that actually can do what it says that it can do, it can host data and compute 100% on chain, which in turn enables pretty much anything that can be utilized with blockchain can be built on internet computer. Now I ask you, can your blockchain, can it do that? Can it really? Because I rather doubt it.